Hello YouTube, welcome to a new series on Civilization 6 Gathering Storm Scenario um, The Black Death I was, Oh yeah, the World War 2 one is multiplayer scenario I'm guessing Actually, I'm just going to quickly check this out. I'm no longer editing uh, these videos Oh, why do I have to go through all this? Uh, why am I doing this to myself? Uh, so yeah, the War Machine is a... Okay, a multiplayer scenario I will... Probably do something with that then. I'll, I'll find. I, I, I have friends. Shut up. I'm going to run things. I am, yeah, 5 in the morning, right after I recorded my first episode of Hungary. Uh, who do I want to be during the Black Death? So, um, in this scenario, you must guide a medieval civilization through the infamous Black Death keeping their cultural and scientific efforts alive as the population falls and faith collapses. The plague will sweep the landscape in waves, killing citizens and rendering tiles unworkable. Can you hold on long enough to sow, to sow the seeds of the enlightenment, or will your nation collapse into disloyalty and despair? So I can be uh, Castile, which is pre-Spain I think it is, uh, Alfonso the 11th, so, Swords of the Faith, all, Cast all Castilian units gain the Holy Fervor unit command. Once per turn, the unit may spend faith to restore its moves and attack. That's pretty nice, but I don't know how the scenario is going to work out. Uh, we can pick the Holy Roman Emperor, Emperor Louis IV. Uh, to, so, th this is the Teutonic Order. A Teutonic Knight unique unit replaces the swordsman. Teutonic Knights have no gold maintenance and plus a guard master when fighting enemy territory. So we are fighting the death? I thought this was going to be like a disease type thing. I don't know how this plays out. I know they did stream at some point today, but I haven't checked it. Anyway, but with England, uh, we, have, we have labor coercion. All English cities gain the coerce command, spend gold to allow a plague stricken tile to work, improve or build for 10 turns. That sounds like something I want to do and, you know, I just realised it's turning Roman Empire not France. I think I'll call that France because King Philip is the French king. Um, anyway, papal leadership. France's government gains a special papal policy wildcard slot. This slot is op optional but consumes faith per turn if used. Okay, I think I'm going to go for Labour Coercion, King Edward III. Surely he won't run long enough. I'm thinking of the right time, aren't I? This is uh, um, Tudor. Ed Edward Tudor, isn't it? Anyway, I'm going to stop. I believe it's Edward Tudor. Um, okay, so I have turned Sean Bean on. I, on. I forgot to look at the animations. From the Hungary episode, you would have seen with Scythia, she looked quite odd, which is weird considering unless I needed to apply my graphics, which I would not have done. No, because I turned the animations off and I played because I just like to quickly run through the game. But anyway, my loading screens take a while, so um, skip this if you want. I thought Sean Bean would read this. Okay, the Black Death ravaged Europe and Western Asia in the mid 14th century, killing a greater share of the population than any other event in world history. The pandemic killed millions, ruined economies, upended political dynasties, and transformed the face of the Western world. Your task is to lead your nation through the calamity, keep your population alive, your economy strong, and your faith unshaken amidst a world of terror and desperation. Yeah, so I picked this one because it's the only plague bonus I saw. But reading it like that, maybe um, I think the Castilian bonus, where you could have a well, you'd have to have a high faith production, so it would be used for something. But we don't know if we need that faith for anything yet. So I am liking the English crown, to be honest. Um, I'm really thinking who's, it's not Edward, I'm thinking, I think Edward Tudor was Edward the fourth, wasn't it, was he Edward the third, I really don't remember, and it's too early, 
Anyway, a new sickness appears. Rumors have spread that a deadly disease has sprung up on bustling ports of the Mediterranean. It may already be on its way to your shores in the holds of trade ships and backs of wagons. Uh, watch your roads and harbors. For the first sign of outbreak, you will need to move quickly and contain the spread. No, should I just burn down my zizzies? Um, I am liking the size of this. Okay, so we have France. We have England with Bordeaux. Okay, yeah. I was looking for more cities. So yeah, we do have the Spanish Empire. That's not Spain, it's Castile. I thought they were... It's Philip, isn't it? Alfonso, no. Okay, I'm thinking really bad time frames. Uh, and Italy, it should really be a part of the Papal States, but... We're not going to worry about that right now. Um, I just wanted to see where the maps reached. Okay. Okay, so we all share the same religion, I'm guessing. Yes, we do. Okay. So, let's have a look to start off with our research. 15 potential. Yeah, sorry, I just read that. Okay, so we can research apprenticeship or castles right now. Apprenticeship gives us guild hall building, uh, which gives plus two culture, plus four gold, and plus four citizen slots, which, wow, this commercial hub building. So that'll give us a lot of bloody gold. Uh, or we can get pikemen in that one. But castles give us walled quarters, which is 15% chance to avoid plague deaths each turn. Gives us plus four housing, which is very nice. Uh, Oh, this is a district. Uh, plus one culture from each adjacent theatre square, gold for commercial square, and the appropriate bonuses for holy sites and caps. This also plus two culture as a base. Um, okay, just looking overall. Oh, you win the scenario when you get to invention. This is a very quick scenario. Uh, Okay, let's have a look at the civics. Is that the same win the scenario? Oh, I think this is just a loop. Okay, so let's see how the ranking is taking place. Oh yeah, we have to... In this scenario, yeah, 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 the plague over 85 turn... Uh, over 85 turns, the black death will sweep across the continent in waves. It originates in poor cities in every nation and spreads outward across the landscape. It can spread to any tile except mountains, well, obviously. And, um, yeah, lost where I completely was. I'm bad at reading. Um, and it will spread more easily to cities, roads, coasts and that contain harbour districts and rural improvements. Okay, when the plague arrives in the tile, it becomes plague stricken for a number of turns. When the, t uh, when the turns are up, the tile will recover, but while plague stricken, it suffers the following effects. Plague stricken tiles cannot be worked by citizens, cannot be improved or repaired, cannot be used to construct districts or add buildings to a district already exists. If the tile is city centre, there is a chance that one population will die each turn that the plague remains. <laughs> uh, units end their turn to plague stricken. Uh, yeah takes 20 damage to combat the black death look to preserve your city's power to keep working through the calamity build essential districts while your citizens are able keep your gold and favor reserve high to purchase buildings and units when your cities are crippled establish centers of science and culture early to protect them there uh, yeah okay when play doctors become available use them to safeguard your most vulnerable areas okay so, oh, we're an emperor, yes. Yeah, so they've got bonuses. I was thinking, why is that? It takes less turn. So, we are an emperor, they get bonuses to that straight away. I'm going to quickly show you all the civics. I am spending ages on not even playing this right now. Okay, so we don't have government open now, but our first civic is feudalism, which we get plus 50% production towards civilian units. 50% uh, production towards military, farms and plantations plus one food, unit maintenance minus one gold, um, plus one food from farm improvements. 
which we have no choice to go for right now. So it's more of the choice. I'm thinking we do have Calais, uh, Calais and Bordeaux. We are a war of France, which we're going to have to keep going on. You are not at war with anyone, but Castile is surely at war with the Holy Roman Empire. Okay, no, he's not. Hmm. So France looks like they're going to be really screwed in this one. I'm loving the road network, by the way, within France. Okay. I'm trying to think what the best course of action is here. So we will want to continue the war, obviously. Um. Okay, let's see the prices here. Okay, the prices are pretty reasonable. Just gonna look at the housing. Everywhere it looks like it needs housing right now. Uh, one housing there, one housing, one housing. I don't have enough gold to pay for all this housing. Okay, I think the housing doesn't cause growth, does it? No, it doesn't cause a stunt from growth right now. Uh, I have a builder here, which actually does have a use. Okay. Do holy sites get different JSC bonuses? Pamukal tile. Okay, I don't know what Pamukal tile is. Um, that's an odd one. Shoot with them on fish. What's a Pamukal tile? I do not know what this is. Ah. Was it double M? No, it was single M. Uh, two tile impassable natural wonder. Oh, okay. Um, statement. It reduces bonus theater. K. Okay. So, natural. Where the hell is that? Let's not worry about that right now. Uh, right now, we need to... I'm going to begin the research on castles because the walled quarters would be very nice. I think that's counted as city centre district. I'm not sure, to be honest. Um, industrial zone. I don't have any decent mines here. I could get the bonuses from that, but I think I would prefer... Wait, where's my curve? Where's my commercial hub? Really there. You put it there. <sighs> I'm not gonna get mad at that one. Um Okay, so I'm thinking industrial zone here and we can potentially not a third square. We could potentially put something else up there. You're gonna get plus one, plus one. Okay, I think I want industrial zone because you're on the front. And I'm going to place it here just because we will potentially get another mine there. We could get the plus two here. But I'd rather save that adjacent bonus or something else. There we go, so we're going to keep that. And we're also here going to purchase the granary so we don't have to build it as the rest are going to have to build theirs. So granary, granary, granary. To be honest, I will be adding housing some building farms because most of these places had builders uh granary but what do i do with bordeaux okay calais was lower defenses so you can still build not your water mill or your granary thank you okay i know everywhere needs housing i know okay so, where, what, okay, we're going to put the farm over here because I don't think that actually is in place to have the triangle of farms because, uh, well, it's just not in place. I'm going to set up a little bit here because we're getting extra, we're getting extra two production. Um, because that usually comes through feudalism, feudalism doesn't give us that now, but it does give us plus one food for all farms which is quite a nice bonus. You're gonna stay inside of there for me. I've been to Cork and Dublin. Didn't know they were that far apart. 
increase how much I pay attention. Okay, no, it does create a triangle of farms, which also will get boosted more. Okay, you're gonna come on up. Where I will use you for something. Okay, I'm just gonna knock out more production here, I think. And you will set up on top of that wheat, because that is a nice bonus to get. For whichever city that is in. And this will give us an extra two production on this tile. I'm just gonna use you to stick Columbia Mills on the coast. On the coastal tiles, that'll be useful. I'm gonna also pull up the woods here. Just so we have another triangle of arms. We cannot actually build woods because we won't get to the civic. So I'm gonna to have to build farms in there also. Okay, the plague has arrived in Lancaster, no longer merely a rumour. The disease is now among us and, and the population is descending into terror and panic. The death toll may be inescapable, but we must still keep the city stable while slowing further spread. Uh, not the plague doctor. Okay, so this civilian unit shorten the plague's duration on plague-stricken tiles and restore loyalty to cities. Plague doctors can be used two times. This can... Oh my god, be increased with this Studio Jovena Aralia policy. Uh, I don't know what that is, but it sounds cool. Okay, so Lancaster has been hit. So, which tile? Some good tiles. The city center tile as well. That is unfortunate for me. Okay, Plague Doctor, you will. Mm, could have been purchased. Could have been. What a shoulda gotta. Okay. I'm gonna have to try and knock out a play doctor there. And Rowan has been hit by the plague as well. Slightly unfortunate. There's nothing more we can do. So we're gonna keep moving on. Keep improving. Uh, I can't chop up the woods. Um. Why am I working? All improved tiles. I just want to make sure all tiles I am working on are improved. They are. And let's not worry about you right now. Um. Eh. I'll send. You've got two builds left, as you've got one. So, we'll move you. Well. I think they both had one, so I'm just going to move them anyway. I'm going to stick my lumber mill on the coast again. Okay, so that is my timer telling me that I'm done. That seems quite quick, to be honest. It's been 17 minutes, so I think I'm going to play another turn, and then we will be done. I need to get my culture up, which we don't have the cliffs of Dover, which is unfortunate, because that would be very nice. Um... Where is the commercial hub? Why, why, why is it there? Okay, so theatre districts could be plus one, campus plus one either way, so we could give them bonuses for that. So I think that's what I'm actually going to do. I'm going to leave these two tiles open. And theatre district there. Okay, I want to queue you actually. Um, queue, thank you. Okay. So they'll be giving each other more bonuses. And you have now built that, so thank you. And we shall get plus one either way. Don't have a commercial hub, which will give us plus five gold there. So I'm actually going to remove that and put that on there. Sorry about the noise outside. That is a road sweeping vehicle I think which is interesting I'm actually gonna build a play doctor in York to help out it would be a nice commercial hub there if the AI was not dumb <sighs> but anyway um, I'm actually gonna be done with this episode now uh, sorry this is a short one I'll probably do half an hour in the next one or at least do 10 turns 
but I have been reading a lot in this episode, so I guess I'm kind of excusing myself. But anyway, I hope you have enjoyed this episode. If you did, leave a like on the video, subscribe to see more. Um, I may end up doing these like an hour and upload them like every two days. I don't know. Uh, but yeah, I hope you enjoyed. If you did, leave a like, subscribe to see more, and don't forget to check out my Hungry playthrough, and I'll see you there. Bye.